moving to the next question of today's paper question number 22 all the energy released from the reaction x to y delta g naught of reaction is minus 193 kilojoule per mole is used for oxidizing m positive as m positive to m3 positive plus 2 electron electrode potential is given minus 0.25 volt under standard condition the number of moles of m positive oxidized when one mole of x is converted to y is In this question, delta G naught of the reaction is given. This is minus 193 kilojoule per mole. And this much energy is used for the oxidation of M positive to M3 positive plus 2 electron. First of all, we will calculate the delta G naught for the reaction this oxidation reaction delta g naught for this oxidation reaction is minus nfe naught now in this question the value of n is 2 f is always 96500 coulomb and electrode potential of this reaction is given minus 0.25 volt if we multiply this quantity the answer is coming 48250 joule or this is equal to 48.25 kilojoule per mole. It means 48.25 kilojoule energy is sufficient is sufficient to oxidize oxidize one mole m positive ion the free energy of the given reaction is 193 so 193 kilojoule energy will be used to oxidize to oxidize 193 by 48.25 this is approximately equal to 4 moles it means the given energy can be used to oxidize 4 mole of m positive ion so answer of this question should be 4 Next question of paper is question number 23. For the octahedral complexes of Fe3 positive ion in thiocyanato S and in cyanide ion ligand environments, the difference between the spin only magnetic moment in Bohr's magneton when approximated to the nearest integer is atomic number of iron is given. Let us start this question. Atomic number of iron is given 26 and its electronic configuration will be argon 18 3d6 4s2. In these two complexes iron is present in Fe3 plus state. So in plus 3 state its electronic configuration becomes 3d5 4s0. Three electrons are removed. First complex is the complex of Fe3 positive ion with cyanide, thiocyanide. This thiocyanato ligand is a weak ligand. Ligand is weak filled ligand. And if ligand is weak filled ligand, so no pairing of electrons will be possible possible and Fe3 positive ion will have electronic configuration in d orbital like this if we 
calculate the magnetic moment of this complex this is n n plus 2 bohr magneton now putting the value of unpaired electron in this complex as 5 this is 5 plus 2 bohr magneton or this will be equal to root 35 bohr magneton magneton or this is equal to 5.92 bohr magneton now see the another complex that is the complex of fe3 positive ion with cyanide ligand this cyanide ligand is a strong filled ligand a strong filled ligand and in the presence of a strong filled ligand the d electrons of fe3 positive ion will participate in pairing pairing of electron will take place in this manner total five electrons are present and these two orbitals will remain vacant so now there is only one unpaired electron it means magnetic moment of this complex will be equal to 1 1 plus 2 bohr magneton or this is equal to root 3 bohr magneton or this is equal to 1.73 bohr magneton now in this question we need to find the difference of two spin magnetic moment so this difference will be 5.92 bohr magneton minus 1.73 bohr magneton the difference is coming out 4.188 and since we need to find the answer in a single digit answer so this single digit integer will be 4 and this will be the answer of question so in this question answer will be 4